I'm gonna be showing you seven ways to steal Sunday's diamonds. Look at the diamonds on the inside. Boom! Look at that. Let's go! Because Sunday posted this video on his channel where he used an aimbot to troll me in another video game. No! Oh! <laughs> what? So it's payback time, baby. Let's get it. The first way we're going to be stealing Sunday's diamonds is by making a special cage and bolt cutters and also a paintbrush. This is no ordinary iron cage. As you can see, I can place this down wherever I want to. And when you place it down, the iron bars disappear. And using the paintbrush that we made earlier, we can change the color of the cage. So watch, I can paint this and make it look like regular glass. I can even paint the bottom of the cage to look like any kind of texture I want. So I'm gonna make it look like grass. If I walk up into the section, boom, you get caged. And the only way to get out is by using special bolt cutters, which of course, Sunday does not have. Let's see. I'm going to place the cage right here. Now, using our paintbrush, once again, we are going to color this to be grass colored. Before painting the cage, we're going to place down two blocks of diamond to lure Sunday in. Bam! Now, we're going to make the cage invisible. So now, like, dude, if you saw this, you can't tell me that you wouldn't walk up to it and try to mine these diamond blocks. Even I would try to mine them. <laughs> now, here comes the best part. We're gonna drink the invisibility potion, try to be as sneaky as possible, and wait for Sunday to log back in. He just logged back in. Oh no. Come on, come on. Where's Sunday at? Where is he? Guys, Sunday's leaving his front door. Oh my gosh, he might actually see the diamonds. Stop talking about how beautiful of a day it is, Sunday. Although the weather is beautiful today. Wait, he sees the diamonds. Go for the diamonds, Sunday. Go for the diamonds. I know you can't resist them. He's taking his sweet time and it is literally killing me on the inside. Grab them. He's going up to them. Please. Oh my gosh, please. Wait. Let's go, baby. I cannot believe how well that worked. Oh, look at him. He's trying to mine out with a diamond pick. It's not gonna work, buddy. If only Sunday had these beautiful red bolt cutters he could probably get out of the cage we don't have a lot of time to banter ladies and gentlemen we need to go get his diamonds and get out where did he put all of his diamonds if i were a sunday where would i hide the diamonds inside of my house come on preston we gotta think fast we don't got a lot of time diamonds diamonds where <laughs> dude where are the diamonds yes we got the diamonds ladies and gentlemen oh my gosh and that is a lot of diamonds don't forget this was only the first way to steal sunday's diamonds there are six more and i need everybody right now to leave a like on this video so we can get the ultimate payback on sunday the second way to steal sunday's diamonds is brilliant if i do say so myself we are going to be making a diamond safe using a custom diamond lock with eight blocks of iron. You pop this bad boy in the crafting table or microwave or whatever you want to call it, and boom, you get a safe transformer. Now you can see, when we open up the safe, we have two inventories, our regular inventory and then whatever is inside of the safe. Nobody else can open this except for us. Oh, somehow Sunday managed to escape from our cage. Come on, Sunday, I need you to leave. Yes, that's right, Sunday, leave your house. Now the big concern is how has Sunday added any kind of defenses to his house since we were last here? The news is good today, ladies and gentlemen. A green foil shirt, which comes in the brand new March lit bag, is at PressedStyles.com right now. Oh, I can't believe we are in <laughs> Dude, this is so believable. There is no way he is going to be able to resist putting diamonds into his safe. If you're enjoying these videos, make sure you take the device you're watching this video on, turn it like this, and make that red subscribe button gray, and enable those notifications. Because one day, we will have a 10 mil sub plaque. Wait a second, hold on, wait, Sunday's back, Sunday? Sunday, wait, I was trying to do something. Oh, he's got diamonds. Oh, yes, yes. Yes! Oh my gosh, he opened me up. He literally just opened me up and put diamonds inside of me. Look at the diamonds on the inside. Let's go! Okay, Sunday, you've put your diamonds in me. I need you to leave. Please. What are you doing? No, no, no. You need to, you gotta you gotta go, bro. You gotta <laughs> My guy! Yes! Sunday is leaving and going upstairs, which means it is time for us to leave this area. Okay, go, 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 Preston. We gotta hustle. I think we are safe underneath this tree. Five stacks of diamonds. Not quite as much as the first time, but I know Sunday has even more hidden diamonds in his house. Oh, guys, we've got a problem. I can no longer open Sunday's door, which means he's on to us. He knows something is going on and he's added extra defenses to his house. 
In fact, I can't even break his windows anymore. If I try to break the windows, they replenish immediately. I did think we were gonna have to use this method to steal Sunday's diamonds so soon, but desperate times call for desperate measures. Place four blocks of diamonds around a lot of TNT and you get diamond TNT blocks. Now, I don't know if you guys can see, but we're going to zoom in on the top of the block and you can see a very faint hint of TNT. But to be honest, other than that, it looks just like a regular diamond block. For demonstrational purposes only, I am going to fill this chest with some extra diamonds I have, one of the secret TNT diamond blocks, and using the explosive diamond detonator, if this works how I remember it does, diamonds should go everywhere. Okay, but I gotta stand kind of far back because it's kind of an explosion. Three, two, one, no! Did it work? Hey, ladies and gentlemen, that worked so well. This is the tricky part. We've got Sunday on the second story. I'm gonna drop one of these blocks down here, spam his door, and hopefully he comes inside and picks up the block. Come on, all right, I think that's enough spamming. All right, go, 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 hide, hide, Preston, hide. Drink that invisibility potion, boy. I think our door spamming annoyed him. He's definitely coming outside. Oh, pick it up. Yes, Sunday, pick up that, pick that block up. Don't you, yes, he picked it up. Oh my gosh, but is he, whoa, 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 whoa. Way too close, Sunday, chill, chill. What if he notices the TNT on top of the diamond block? I don't know why I added that. I just thought it looked really nice. Wait a second, okay. Please put it inside of your chest, Sunday. So here's the problem. I don't know if Sunday is placing it inside of his diamond chest. He could be placing it anywhere, but it only works inside of a chest that's filled with other diamonds. All right, dude, it's time in three, two, one. Yeet! Wait, yes! <laughs> Look at all of those diamonds. Oh, Sunday's probably so mad right now. I am going to just get out of here as fast as I can before Sunday notices somebody was outside of his house. I never like killing Endermen because they are very cute but yet aggressive creatures, but we need to kill them. We are going to be transforming into an Enderman to steal Sunday's diamonds. Is it possible? Yes, it is, ladies and gentlemen, I promise you. Not only do we need Ender Pearls to transform into an Enderman, but we also need an Enderman's head. I can tell, this Enderman's definitely gonna drop one. Come on, Enderman. Yeah, there we go. Hey, <laughs> we got a free grass block as well. This is almost as delicate as real life surgery, but we have to place eight Ender Pearls in the crafting table with the Enderman head in the middle. And we get an Enderman transformer. But wait, there's more. Using two sticks and one ender pearl, we get a teleporter. Oh, dude, look at how cool this looks. Hey, what is that? Hey, what? Hey, guys, you're stealing blocks from my house. That's not okay. Okay, this kind of hurts a little bit when you turn into the enderman, but let's go. Yeet, transform. You are now an enderman, which means we can use the teleporting staff to teleport to any location. So the main problem with the teleporting staff is you can't necessarily choose where you teleport. It just kind of teleports teleports you around the area, kind of like if you eat a chorus fruit. Before we teleport into Sunday's house, do me a favor, everybody. If you haven't already, check out the Preston Styles merch at PrestonStyles.com. We got brand new headbands, t-shirts, hoodies, all kinds of cool stuff for you guys and gals. Yeah, and it looks like it. Sunday's doors are still locked, and I still cannot break any of his windows. Here we go. Three, two, one, yay! No, my guy, come on, teleport me. Eventually this is going to work. Oh wow, it actually worked on the second try. That was way too lucky. <laughs> Look at this, sunday has got like hamburgers on the floor. What is he doing with hamburgers on the floor? They go in your mouth, Sunday, not on the floor. I know he's got those diamonds somewhere. We already took the diamonds from this chest. Wait a second. <gasps> Three stacks of diamonds for Preston. Yo, Sunday must be getting low on diamonds. I don't know how many diamonds we blew up earlier, but it might have been a lot. Maybe I should have been a little bit more careful with how many diamonds I exploded. Um, okay, now I gotta figure out how do I get down from here? Oh my gosh, there is really no safe way to turn into an Enderman and use this teleporting staff. It's completely at random, but I love it. Oh, dude, I can't believe we have to do this, but we actually have to tame 
a phantom. Yeah, that's right. This isn't clickbait. This phantom guy who keeps damaging me, we need to tame him because we need him to steal the diamonds from the Sunday. Fun fact, my mom always calls Sunday, Sunday. You can't eat Sunday. He's not ice cream. This phantom is kind of bullying me. It's a bit of a delicate process. You put three gold ingots like this to get the mouthpiece, four more to make the base of the phantom charmer. Then you combine these two together to get the full phantom charmer. I don't know if this actually works 100%. Here goes nothing. Is it working? Oh, it's working! Yes! Wow! I can't believe it was that easy to tame a phantom. Why have I not used this earlier? Oh, look at him! Finally! Oh my gosh, yo, dude, this is so cool. Look at this! He's actually not attacking us! He's our friend! Just like with a dog, I'm going to teach this phantom how to take diamonds. Bring me the diamond, Fanty. I'm gonna call him Fanty. I think it's a cute name. Come on, you can do it. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Oh my gosh, dude. What? Oh! What? Okay, seriously? Maybe phantoms are just way smarter than dogs, but that never worked with my dog on the first try. And I've been trying to get him to steal Brianna's diamonds for a long time. I need you to listen up here, Fanty. This is your big test. This is Sunday's house. Bring me Sunday's diamonds. Come on, you can do it, Fanty. We practiced this, remember? You were born for this mission. Go, Fanty! Go and steal those diamonds from the Sunday. He's going into Sunday's chimney. He's like a reverse Santa Claus. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm getting worried. I haven't heard anything from Fanty. How did Fanty get inside through the chimney? There's no way. Where did he go? <gasps> yes, Fanty's opening up chests. Take those diamonds. Yes. Yes, Fanty. He's getting more diamonds. Wait, I just saw him go up the chimney. Fanty, you are a legend. Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't leave a like for Fanty, come on. Fanty, bring me those diamonds, you handsome man, you. Oh my gosh. Five stacks of diamonds for Fanty. You know what, Fanty? You get to keep a diamond because you are such a good boy. There you go. Don't spend it all in one place. Things are starting to heat up now that we've stolen so many diamonds from Sunday. We are in a cave system right now looking for the fabled man. Magicite ore. If you're familiar with my videos, it looks something like this. It's basically a living and breathing ore. And when you mine it, you get this incredibly epic Magicite orb. And using a crafting table, you can then craft the Magicite staff. This thing is so overpowered, when you right-click a block, it becomes phaseable, which means you can now walk into it. Oh, dude, this is so cool. So what I can keep doing, oh my gosh, okay. Oh, 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 oh. I almost just died with the Magicite one. That would have been so embarrassing. Oh, we're invisible right now in front of Sunday's house. Look at those diamonds. Dude, I thought for sure we blew up all of his diamonds with a TNT detonator, no. Of course, Sunday had a hidden vault from us the entire time. You know what? I'm not even gonna wait for Sunday to leave his house. Okay, we gotta be really careful about how we use this thing, though. I don't know if we can phase from this section of the house. I think it's working. Oh my gosh, it's working. Dude, look at us. Where are we? Okay, there's a block above our head. We gotta phase this. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe that. Wait, can we? Oh my gosh. Wait, okay, Sunday just left his house. Dude, we can also use this as an escape route. Like, check this out. We just got to go right back into it, and we are golden. All right, Sunday. And you know what? Just in case, if Sunday decides to come back early, I am going to use this on the two blocks in front of his door, so when he tries to come into it, he's going to fall into it. I saw those diamonds up there, Sunday. Oh, this is so cute. Look, he thinks this vaulted door is going to keep me from getting inside. The Magicite one says, nah, -uh, ladies and gentlemen. Holy cactus! There are so many diamond blocks inside of here! Dude! And even the chest inside of here have diamonds inside of them! What? <laughs> Wait a second! Guys, I accidentally used the Magicite staff on the diamond blocks, and we can no longer mine these. I've got enough diamonds to keep me happy for a very long time. What if we turn all of these diamond blocks into troll blocks? If we use the Magicite wand on all of these blocks, Sunday will never be able to mine these again. Guys, this is literally the ultimate troll. We are walking through all of the diamond blocks, which can no longer be mined. All right, I'm getting out of here, guys. We're gonna go out through the roof. Wait a second, I am now inside. Sunday's attic. I do not want to be here. All right, we're dropping through. Whoa, okay, we went too deep. Oh, no. Um, guys, okay, you know what? Eventually, we will find a way to get out and be safe with the diamonds we collected from Sunday's house. Oh, what? I think Sunday has officially lost his mind. His house is literally covered in a giant obsidian 
case. It's like a sarcophagus. I have never seen somebody do this. And I have stolen diamonds from a lot of different YouTubers. Whoa, dude. He made a roof out of glass, but we still can't break it. How does this guy get materials that are so strong? Is that a nether portal? <laughs> He's got a nether portal. I think that's the only way he can leave his house right now. Oh, look at him in the chat. I'd like to see someone break in now. You hear me out there? He still has no... Wait, he just went... Oh, why did he just go into the nether? Heather, you might not notice it right away, but look at this. That is Sunday's house. This is a duplicate of Sunday's house. It took me so long to make this. So please don't ask how long it took. You, you, you really don't want to know. And to prove to you guys that I made this house, if I try to break the glass, it actually breaks. This is a nether portal swapper. This is going to allow me to swap the nether portals from this one all the way over to Sunday's nether portal. Now that the portals have been swapped, when he comes back from the nether, he's going to think he's inside of his house, but really, he's inside of the replica house I spent way too long building. Time to glup up another invisibility potion. I've got to walk all the way back to the duplicate house. This is going to take some time. Shh, I can hear Sunday coming back. Come on. Oh, there he is, there he is. He's coming back with his diamonds. How did you get diamonds from the nether? Wait, unless... Does Sunday have a secret nether diamond vault? Bruh, I would have never thought about putting diamonds in the nether to keep them safe. Not in a million years. He's going back to the nether. What? He didn't notice. In this house, I can actually open up the door. Sunday, where did you put these dim diamonds? I know you put some diamonds in here, Sunday, from the nether. Ladies and gentlemen, another successful episode of Stealing Diamonds from another YouTuber. Don't forget, if you comment in the first hour of a brand new video being uploaded, I feature your comments right here. And also click either one of these YouTube videos that are being recommended to you because they are awesome. 